Welcome back, Internet people. My name is Ryan, and this is a robot dog. We're playing Follow New Vegas right. for the PC. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. So. Yeah, um, about that favor you owe me. Ask away. Can you get me into the strip? Sure can. I have a friend who has just what you're looking for. Has a shop over yonder by the east gate named Mick and Ralph. Just tell Ralph that I sent you. And he'll get you squared away. Okay. Hooray! Hey. So... I have access to the strip now. Or... I will have access to the strip very shortly. But, before going and... Stripping... At the strip, because that's what people do there. I am going... Oh my god. Oh what my god, I cannot handle you every single time I walk into this place. It, it can be bought. It can be ah, 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 Okay, one moment. I'm getting out of here. Get out of here! I hate you! I hate you so much! Every single time, every single time I walk past here, you always have to say, come to Mick and Ralph's for your shopping needs, and I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. You stupid little kid. You stupid little kid. I hate you so much. Anyway, so, uh... <laughs> Um, what, what, what were we doing again? Right. Right, we were, uh... We were helping a... We were helping a robot dog. Is what I wanted to do. <laughs> Instead of... Going straight to New Vegas. Right. <laughs> and then... Ah! 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 Ah, what's going on? What's going on? Oh god, why do you hate me? Is it because I beat children? <laughs> okay, I think I may have angered people because I decided to beat a child. So we're just gonna <laughs> We're just gonna reload the save game I made before I began to beat the child with the it golf can club. Be it can be found at Mick and Ralph. <laughs> um Yeah, so, uh, how are you guys doing, internet people? How are you guys doing? I'm doing great. Welcome. Th thank you. The king said you could tell me more about his robotic dog. Rex? It breaks my heart every time I see him. He's such a good dog. The king brought him here for treatment then? Yes, a few months ago. We had to tell him there was nothing we could do. So you can't heal him? No. Rex's condition is way beyond anything we can handle. He requires brain surgery and some sophisticated cybernetics work, too. Is there anyone who could do all that? There's an old scientist named Dr. Henry who reportedly specializes in this sort of procedure. He'd probably be your best bet. Last I heard, he was living up in Jacobstown, far to the northwest. Thank you. You've been very helpful. No problem. Okay. Good day. So. Hello, Beatrix. You're wearing the same clothes that the person that follows me around is wearing. Howdy. So, who are you? I've been around a while. Currently working for the followers as a gun for hire. But it's getting rather dull. Aside from protecting them from the occasional thug looking to intercept supply shipments, there isn't much to do around here. The one researcher I liked, who I could chat up about liquor, got transferred. And the rest of the docs are pretty uptight about my kind of fun. Oh. Okay. You probably have something interesting to say, but quite frankly, your face is grossing me out, so I'm just gonna run away on ya. <laughs> Does that make me racist? I don't like rotting flesh in front of me. It's gross. <laughs> I 
<laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. I took a <laughs> I took a short break and I've calmed down about the child. I've calmed down. Everything will be fine. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. Yes, 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 yes. Julie Farkas and a man in Jacobstown can treat Rex. She said, what? Why didn't she just say so when I was there? Actually, come to think of it, I was pretty angry when I went down there. I vaguely recall something about upending a few tables, maybe knocking out one of her doctors. Anyway, that's incredible news. Only thing is, there's too much going on around here for me to make a trip like that. And I need all of my guys just to keep things settled here. You seem to be awfully interested in my boy Rex here. And you've done some good work for me already. I'll tell you what. You promised to get Rexy here to that doctor. And I'll lend him to you. What do you say? Oh my god, I totally want a robot dog. Absolutely. I, he's normally... Yeah, second, yeah. He doesn't like hats. That should be it, though. I probably should have listened to that dialogue. But I'm just so excited to get a robot dog. Oh. Let's have a conversation, Rex. How are you feeling, boy? No. Oh. Robot dog. I have a robot dog. Hee. <laughs> okay. So, where is Jacobstown? Oh, Christ. I didn't realize how large this map was. I thought this was it. Wait a minute, wasn't this one, wasn't this the place that was, uh, taken over by the, or no, that was somewhere down here, that was near, that was over here, there was a town, there's a, a city or a town over here somewhere that's been taken over by the Legion, but I'm guessing that's on this side of the river over here, because that's closer to the river, so this is probably safe. Um... Well, it looks like this is the way to get there, so, uh, let's do that. Let's fix the dog. Dog fixin'. It is a profession that you see very often. Um, Service Canada runs this lovely website that has a bunch of, like, sure like, jo like jobs for sale, and, and dog, f dog repair person is, is one of the options, I would know. Can, uh, pick that search for jobs and no 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 alcoholism for you Silv 5r rush is what that sign back there said go ahead rebind the video a little bit I'll wait <laughs> okay okay what is that it looks like a spaceship. Oh, it's just part of a silo. That's suddenly not interesting anymore. If it was a spaceship, then hells yeah, I'm gonna go investigate a spaceship, but no. Half of a silo. Boring! Creeping into this likely dangerous locale. Actually, it's probably not gonna be all that dangerous. Like, why would anything dangerous be out here? Well, I don't know. When we started getting to places like this in Fallout 3, in this corner of the map, there were uh, Death Claws and Yaogwai. Don't feed those ones. Don't feed the Yaogwai. And all sorts of dangerous things. Which sort of made sense, you know. A little bit. But out here, there just appears to be rocky crags and a road. And some bebbles. And a sign. I'm going down the 157 Nevada Road. Excellent. Excellent. Uh oh, I see a big horn.
Let's go. Hooray! <laughs> Look at it roll down the hill in flames. Delicious. Do I want to go in there? Not particularly. Not right now. Maybe I'll come back there later. There appear to be quite a few big horners around here. So I guess that's something. They're not particularly dangerous to me. Especially considering I have a robot dog and a sharpshooter with me. Oh, and this thing. But, uh... Yes. Wait, are those trees? Those are honest-to-God trees. I haven't seen... Jesus Christ, these are real trees. This is shocking. They're obviously not the same sort of trees as the ones that we were introduced to in Oblivion. So I'm pretty sure instead of hiring game designers, they hired people who knew how to work with speed tree. But, uh, trees. Is there supposed to be trees up here? Or is this an odd occurrence? Is this something where we are far enough out? In well, no. We are in the wasteland so far that it has actually still broken the... And then the fight. Oh, something's, something's angry, something's mad and angry. Oh, it's just mantises. Take care of the mantises for me. Why is this taking so long? Thank you. Is there another one? No, did you kill it? Okay. But, um... Well, I guess it's been a while since the bombs fell, so... If this place wasn't irradiated, then I guess they could have just uh, regrown. Sure could use a drink. Oh my god. Do you want me to beat you with a golf club too? Because I will do it. I will beat you with a golf club. <laughs> oh, more mantises. Let's, uh... That's right. Oh, am I poisoned? I think I'm poisoned. It doesn't seem to be doing anything to my health, though, so I don't care. Oh, uh, it's probably doing making other effects, though. I should look. Oh, well then. Never mind. So this is quite a nice walk. Out in the distance. I do believe I saw this level on a racing game for the PlayStation 2. <laughs> that's, what's, that's what the graphics look like, right? Oh, I love to dig on this game so much. It's so easy. Okay, so I see some hulking robots over there. Robots? Oh, super mutants. Stupid big owners. We're making noise all night again. What what is this nonsense? Why are there super mutants and why aren't they attacking me? And their skin is different than the skin. Welcome to Jacobstown, human. You're free to walk around. Just don't stare at the nightkin. They don't like people looking at them. And if you're NCR, keep it to yourself. They're not popular around here. Um. Why aren't you talking like a retard? Why do you... I don't, I don't understand what's happening. This is shattering my perceptions of the Fallout world, because I haven't played any of the earlier Fallouts, and I'm assuming all of you are raving lunatics at all that only just want to murder people. Except for the two in Fallout. That, I don't know. Okay, I'll run with it. Whatever. I'm looking for Dr. Henry. Docks inside the lodge. Okay. I have some questions about Jacobstown. Such as? I'd like to know about you. Was part of a super mutant army. Ran a town. 
walk the wasteland with the tribal. Now I'm here. Super mutant army? Long story, so here's the short version. The Master created the super mutants and Nightkin. The Master thought he could unify everyone. No more differences, no more war. It didn't end well. No. Uh, are there any town rules I need to know about? Same as any civilized town. Don't start any fights or steal anything. We'll treat you fair. Not a lot to ask. Okay, what's wrong with the Nightkin, though? Nightkin suffers schizophrenia from the stealth boys they're always using. One of the reasons I settled Jacobstown was so they could be cured. While they're in town, the Nightkin aren't allowed to have stealth boys, so their craziness doesn't get worse. Trouble is, the Nightkin don't like being visible, either. They don't take being exposed too well. Oh. So why do some of the super mutants here dislike the NCR, despite the fact that I wasn't aware of that and that it's a dialogue option for pretty much no reason? A lot of bad blood between super mutants and humans goes back years. Some here still got the scars and memories. Me? I don't really have a problem with the NCR. Set their sights a little too high sometimes, but they try. Legion? That's another story. No. What do you know about the Legion? Kaisar thinks he can change human nature. Most of the Legion is following Kaisar, not Kaisar's ideals. When he's gone, it'll crumble. Might not happen overnight. Might take a few decades, but it'll happen. Basic human nature. Greed, ambition, jealousy. We'll see to it. You know, frankly, you're probably the most interesting person in this entire game I've spoken to up to this point. So what makes the NCR too ambitious? They expand. Fast. If you got land they want, they'll take it. Eventually. Did it out west? They'll do it here. They keep rolling over people. They'll regret it. That's how revolutions start. Hmm. Uh, do you have any dealings with New Vegas? Not really. Heard it's a paradise in the wasteland. Never been there myself. Doubt they'd let a mutant in. Amazes me people would come from all over the waste to throw away everything they've got in that town. Hmm. Seen them grow from a single town, Shady Sands, into the Republic. They've done good for the most part. Oh, that would have been helpful during that test. Oh, I was totally right. Did I answer Shady Sands? I totally did. I knew that. All right. Goodbye. See you. I was really hoping you were going to give me a quest or something. That guy was actually smart, talked without a stupid voice, and he was a super mutant. Whoever, okay, okay, whoever wrote that character, if you happen to be watching this video, which I seriously doubt that you are, you are the person that should be writing most of the quests, because you know how to write dialogue that isn't obnoxious. Um, okay, so what am I doing? I'm looking for the doctor. There's probably all sorts of interest. Jesus, this is a nice place. This is a nice place, you know, considering it's probably full, it's full of smelly super mutants and smelly bighorners. So glad there isn't smell of vision for Xbox or PC just yet. Anyway, I think we're going to make that a video, though, before we explore this majestic expanse in the wasteland. So uh, thanks for watching, Internet people. We'll see you again later.